They're two battleground states, Michigan and Wisconsin, whose late into the night vote counts four years ago descended into chaos, but only one has made major changes to help avoid this. What we see here is essentially an increasing mob-like scene. Protesters harassing poll workers in Detroit, scrambling to count the surge of absentee ballots. My life was threatened. My staff's life was threatened. Now, a new law in Michigan gives clerks a head start, allowing them to process absentee ballots well before Election Day. I think it would show uh, voters that the process is clean, that the process is open. The changes will likely limit a so-called red mirage on election night. That's what happened in 2020, when many cities reported in-person voting results first, which tended to favor Republicans. But absentee ballots, which were more Democratic-leaning, took longer to count. 100% reporting didn't take place until Wednesday morning. Trump's lead in Michigan vanished later that morning when Detroit's Wayne County reported nearly 150,000 votes. Predictable changes that were used to fuel false claims of illegal ballot dumps. And then boom, all of a sudden, I go from winning by a lot to losing. With this new law, when will Detroit have its results posted? We'll have our results posted by 11 o'clock news. 90 to 95 percent of our results will be posted by then. In the week before Election Day, you'll actually see these envelopes opened and the ballots put into vote tabulators here in Michigan. While here in Wisconsin, you may see results come in later. That's because absentee ballots stored here cannot even be opened until Election Day. Regardless of the efficiencies we make, just the sheer number makes us be one of the last people, if not always the last jurisdiction, to report results. In 2020, Milwaukee finished counting at 3.42 a.m., pushing Biden ahead in Wisconsin. Do you have any projection for when Milwaukee will have its vote reported this year? I don't. Um, I think what we should expect, though, is not before midnight. 43 states allow clerks to process ballot envelopes before Election Day. But despite bipartisan efforts to change election laws, that doesn't include critical battlegrounds Pennsylvania and Wisconsin. If the American public wants to see our results sooner, there has to be legislative change. A change to speed up the count in the most competitive states. Shaquille Brewster, NBC News, Detroit.